New at 11, a one-year-old killed after a dresser falls on him. Investigators are calling it an accident. His family is now urging others to take precautions to prevent the tragedy. CBS 46's Sierra Cummings talked to his mother, who needs help getting the word out. The Williams family is not alone in this. In just the last two decades, more than 500 deaths were caused by furniture falling, shelves like this coming out, or the entire thing trapping a child. Just nine days ago, one-year-old Kaysen died after an unsecured shelf fell on him. Kaysen was put down for a nap. Um, he got up playing and climbed on top of a dresser, and the dresser fell on him, taking away his ability to cry. That's what mom, Samaya Williams, says investigators told her last Wednesday after a family member who was babysitting found him. Playful, loud, jumpy. In fact, it's hard to find a picture where the toddler is not smiling or playing. Even if they sleeping or playing, eating, anything, check on your child often. The grief is heavier, the young mother says, because she's always been around to protect Kaysen, except for this one time. Officials are looking into the make and brand of the dresser shelf, but the family learned it was unleveled and unsecured. An issue the U.S. Consumer Product Safety Commission found to be the cause in about 550 deaths since the year 2000. You cannot judge a dresser, whether it's going to be tippy or not just by looking at it. The group Consumer Reports just began calling for a mandatory furniture standard beyond manufacturer warning labels. Test a company would be required to pass which ensures stability. A safety measure, Samaya Williams. Does anything could happen under a second. Now wants to see. Sierra Cummings, CBS 46 News.